Bristol City for Crystal Palace 1, Roy Hodgson suffers yet another miserable result. The veteran boss suffered another humiliating night as his Crystal Palace side didn't just get knocked out of the Carabao Cup by championship team Bristol City, they were thrashed. And there was even a horror rerun of that awful night in Nice as Iceland international hoarder Magnussen set up one of City's goals with a long throw. With 39 minutes gone and his struggling Premier League side having just let in an equaliser, another Magnussen took a leaf out of Aaron Gunnarsson's book as he hurled the ball into Palace's box. Defenders Martin Kelly and James Tompkins failed to deal with it, leaving City substitute Milan Jurek to drive it into the roof of the net to put championship Bristol City 2-1 up. Admittedly Hodgson wouldn't have been thinking of resigning after this one like he did when England got knocked out by Iceland. He'd made clear where the Carabao Cup stood on his list of priorities compared to fighting relegation by making 10 changes from the side that lost at Newcastle on Saturday. Unluckily Patrick Van Anhalt, the one man who had kept his place, had already cost Palace a goal a few minutes earlier by heading the ball straight to Matty Taylor to volley home from 8 yards. The spell summed up bottom of the Premier League table Palace's desperate season. They had started well enough with Korean Lee Chung Yong stinging City goalkeeper Luke Steele's hands after only seven minutes with a ferocious volley. And they deserved to take the lead when Bakri Sako ran onto Ruben Loftus Cheek's incisive pass before beating Steele in the bottom left hand corner. But even among a group of players who have mostly not been heavily involved in first-team action, the lack of confidence was alarming as City were allowed to get back in the game. Lee Johnson's side, beaten 3-0 by Leeds on Saturday to drop out of the championship playoff places, were even able to shrug off the loss of record-signing striker Femura Diedia to injury.